Me comes home after a bad day. My dog who's happy that I'm home. Yo, what is going on everybody? My name is Adam and welcome back to Plip Plop. My job is to find some of the internet's spiciest memes and deliver them directly to you. So with all that being said, let's get started. If life gives you limes, make margaritas. I drew the weekend. So I actually went and confirmed this. He actually did make it his profile picture, which is absolutely amazing. Can you find the present that doesn't belong? Sneak boy. Dad, someone in the internet said I'm the most ridiculous dancer in the world. Ignore him. Why? Just do it. Me trying to fit in with my weird friends. Uh, like this? Six-year-old me when my dad puts batteries in my toy and it starts working again. So awesome! POV, you are my friend. He do be smiling, though. He gets angry if I take this off. I mean, I would too, to be honest. He, I mean, why you gotta mess with his fit? Me, an introvert, the Uber driver who didn't talk the entire ride. Yeah, that's an immediate five stars for me. Notice the similarities? Yeah, checkmate atheists. Six months ago, I said, bees are lovely, aren't they, to my mom. Yeah, that you're, you are the bee girl now. That's you. Nobody, my little bro trying to fight me. So cute. Oust, ing. Oh no, they're gonna get run over! Outstanding move. Thank you for saving us, chess man. Happy New Year, Lieutenant Dan. Damn, he's, he's really going through it right now. I think Lieutenant Dan pretty much embodies all of 2020. When you did an outstanding job handling the flashlight. Not bad, kid. Pretty elite dad compliment, if you ask me. People who manage to continue the story of their dream after they fall back asleep. Where can I learn such power? My friend who's married and has kids. Me, who gets excited when some random girl smiled my way. Ah, <sighs> it, it'd be like that. Wanna hear something interesting? Security guard at school. 11.59 on 12.31.2020. 12 o'clock on 1-1-2021. 1 12.01, 1 1-1-2021. Dad, you're a superhero. No, son, you are. Me and Dad the next day. Father disowned me on Christmas for being trans. 31-year-old dad here. Shoot me a message if you ever need some dad words. 37-year-old dad here. Also happy to lend an ear if you need it. 37-year-old mom here if you need anything. Know your worth and everything. Your happiness is the only concern. Random 25-year-old Russian. Random 25-year-old Russian here if you need disappearing act. Random 16-year-old Australian here. I'm completely fucking useless. Disclaimer, I can't really do an Indian accent, so random 19-year-old Indian here, I can help you with tech support scams. Pause your game and do the dishes. One sec, one sec, it's a multiplayer game. Oh, okay. Did you just understand me? This is a complete and utter fantasy. No mom in the history of the world has ever understood that concept. Me finally having the self-confidence I deserve. People trying to crush me. How nice. How very, very nice. Nobody. My grandma. Don't tell nobody I gave you this. Grandma, grandma a real one for that. An ugly Christmas ornament I made when I was little. Cast it into the fire. Destroy it. No. Your mom in the morning when you had friends over. Prepare the feast. My 40th cigarette this afternoon. That deserves a star. There's some good positive reinforcement for you. JK, don't smoke, guys. Indian dude blows into a weird pipe. Snake. Yo, this MF spitting. All I have ever wanted from a yogurt is to know who the cows are. Yeah, can we normalize this for all animal products? I want to see the names. I want to know what they're into. Me, when someone calls me handsome, my friend sending me a meme. Me who made the meme and posted it on Reddit. Oh, you sweet summer child. 
2020 in 2021. So far, nothing too crazy has happened, but yeah, we'll see. Crush exists. My heart. No entry. Entrance only. Seven-year-old me sleeping peacefully on my bed. My dad who picked me up from the sofa. It ain't much, but it's honest work. Me and the boys after we get permission to go on a sleepover. Top 10 best feelings in the world. When you go to an old friend's house and still auto-connect to the Wi-Fi. I'm still worthy. Love is in the air. Or some sort of ancient dark omen. He is smiling. All right, this is actually really cute. Where, where are my possum fans at out there? Me showing my little brother the song I've been practicing. When was the last time I hugged you? I don't know, last year? So, I heard this story secondhand many years ago, but the gist was that a friend of a friend lived in what was generally considered a bad neighborhood because he was a super poor college student and was what he could afford. He didn't have any furniture, he just slept on a blanket on the floor and he had a milk crate for a chair and like an old wire spool as a table. No TV, nothing in the fridge, no microwave, basically just bare walls and a roof to keep the weather off. So one day he comes home and there's a man in his apartment just standing there with this look of utter amazement and horror on his face and he turns to the guy who just entered and says, this is your place? Cause I broke in to rob you but shit man you ain't got nothing. Wait here, I'm gonna be right back. And the burglar left, leaving a puzzled college student alone in his empty apartment. But sure enough, the burglar came back a while later and brought some friends. And they delivered a table, a couple of chairs, and a small TV. I think I got you a bed, too, but that might take a couple days. So, the poor college student made some friends, and he didn't ask where they got the stuff. The burglar. Well, maybe I don't want to be the bad guy anymore. Look, I really want to believe this story is real, but it kind of feels like it's getting into r slash that happened territory, so, I don't know. What do you guys think? Me about to fail my final exam! Random Indian dude on YouTube. Yeah. On behalf of all of us, random Indian dude on YouTube, thank you. You are seen, you are heard, and you are appreciated. Me, every time a girl says to me that I look beautiful. Thanks, mom. Mommy issues anyone? Huh? No? Just me? Okay. Crush. Honestly, why do you love me so much? Me with a list full of her pros. Observe. If you're not listing out all of the positive traits of your crush, is it even is it even real love at that point? I mean, come on. Pajamas. Day gown. Lingerie. 2021. New year, new me. Nah, never mind. But 2022, though. Watch out. Looking at pictures and videos of cute animals for 30 minutes can relieve stress and anxiety, according to a University of Leeds study. Me, after watching cute animal videos the whole day. Yes, I am invincible. Yeah, does anyone else just type in baby, insert animal here on Google Images and just go ham? When you finally beat the boss you were struggling on. Hmm. Hmm. Looking at you, Dark Souls. When you surprise your parents with good grades. Surprise, mother father! A uh, couple C pluses. I try to save memes and send them in the morning when I know my friends are awake because I don't want to wake them. Or you could just spam them at 3 a.m. like I do. I don't know. Both work. When you visit your grandma and she says you got a little bit taller. Psh, stop playing. You gonna make me act up? Wait, wait, no, never mind. Look, there's a human. Yeah? He's looking a little unhealthy, isn't he? Yeah. Let's help him exercise. Yeah. Yes, both of those clouds were played by Joey Wheeler from Yu-Gi-Oh. They don't know my son is winning. What an unexpected combination of memes. You're not just a cat girl to me. You lift me up higher than anyone ever could and you give me the power to get through anything in my way. Every day is an adventure with you that I wouldn't give up for the world. Oh, that face when no cat 323 DLGF. That's it for today, folks. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to pay your respects by ever so elegantly tapping that like button and respectfully slapping us with a subscribe. Thanks for sticking around and see you in the next one.